When you're pregnant and you're growing someone brand new in your body from scratch, it can be so, so tiring. Physically, emotionally, mentally. Yeah, you can be feeling a little bit hormonal, a little bit up and down. You have good days, you have bad days. Being pregnant can also be quite worrying. For me personally, I'm a little bit concerned about how I'm gonna cope having two. Um, already it's been extra tiring having a toddler and being pregnant, but now I'm starting to think, how is it gonna be when the baby's born and I've got Jack running around? So that's kind of preying on my mind and making me a little bit stressed. Also we're putting on weight, so not just on our tummy but in other places that we might not necessarily want it to be. For me it's my face and my boobs and my bum um, and that kind of makes you feel a bit sluggish and lethargic. Again, like no one really talks about these things. I feel like there's not actually that much emotional support for women when you're pregnant. We have loads of physical checks with the midwife but there's no one really asking you how you're doing. So for this reason, I kind of feel like when you're pregnant, you have to look after yourself and really, really kind of take control of the situation. And for me, relaxation in pregnancy is so, so, so important. People kind of expect mums to be tough, but sometimes it's hard. So this video is just gonna be me giving you guys some tips about how I relax. Um, and some small changes I've made to my life to make me, yeah, just feel a bit calmer, more relaxed, and generally feel better in myself. I know it sounds really simple, but even lighting a candle, especially if it's a scented candle, for me can work absolute wonders. When it's really nice is if you have time at the beginning of the day when you're getting ready or at the end of the day when you're winding down ready for bed, just lighting a scented candle sends me into such a happy, relaxed place. I love this one from Planet Organic, although I'm not sure they sell it anymore because I think it was a special Christmas edition. So another favorite of mine is the Neon brand. They have this one called the Home Happiness Candle and it's amazing. I have a habit of bathing with Jack, which as lovely as it is, it's just not the same. So try and take a bath for yourself. I've recently started using magnesium flakes, which are 100% safe in pregnancy and really help ease any back pain that you might have. So for me, I've just developed back pain now. I'm about 29 weeks and I just have a bath with some of the magnesium flakes and afterwards I just come up feeling so good. Even a nice shower will do especially if you have a really, really good shower gel like this one. I love, love, love this one. It smells so divine, I just kind of want to eat it. Also, don't forget to apply stretch mark oil. So this can kind of turn a shower or a bath into a mini pampering session. I absolutely love this one. I just lather it on and you have an oil for the nighttime and then you have more of a cream for the daytime, which is super, super moisturizing. I put it on my bump, my boobs, my thighs, wherever really. Another thing that I absolutely love doing is pregnancy yoga. So I've always loved yoga, but since becoming pregnant, I've really tried to keep it up. In fact, if you search on my Instagram for toddler yoga challenge, you'll see all the fun I've had with Jack trying out different yoga positions and more recently, pregnancy yoga. It just helps you zone out and crucially, it helps your body prepare for labor. Meditation has also been really, really amazing for me and something I've got more and more into since becoming pregnant. I don't do anything formal, I just sit, close my eyes and try and let myself drift off into another universe. It's so relaxing. Even something like cooking helps me relax. Just making a really simple meal on the weekend can make me feel really good. This is a really important one. Disconnect people. We get so much information these days, it can be complete overload. Inspired by Hannah Mags and her husband, Sam and I try and do one night a week where we just switch our phones off, don't look at them, and we're just together. And it's super, super nice, and it's so relaxing. Another thing I've been doing is practicing hypnobirthing. So there's just a couple of my tips that I use to try and relax and I've been doing throughout my pregnancy. I sometimes forget them and then I'm like feeling a bit stressed and I'm like, okay, I need to have a bath or like, okay, I need to do some pregnancy yoga or I need to take a walk outside. So yeah, I, uh, I hope you enjoyed them and thanks so much for watching. Give me a thumbs up or subscribe to my channel. Leave me a comment below. I love hearing from you guys. So yeah, thank you. Bye.